Steam Deck's not doing what I'm, Stream Deck isn't doing what I want it to. That's a little unfortunate, but that's okay. Good evening, everyone. Happy whatever day today is. I seriously don't remember what day it is. Um, help. What day is it? Happy Wednesday, everyone. Look, it's been a day. It's been, it's been an interesting day. Hold on. Need to sit up straight not crunch up and be a little shrimpy boy i don't need to be a shrimp nope don't need to do that so I'm gonna sit up straight and start start talking to people like i'm someone who knows how to sit up straight yeah so happy wednesday it is wednesday according to my calendar and according to my phone and according to my computer so happy wednesday everybody oh yeah it's wednesday because i got my stream deck in i got a stream deck and that's complicated and I don't know how to use it that well and it's already giving me trouble like this is me trying to change the volume of um, the music you see how it's not getting any louder or quieter I don't know what I've done wrong uh, I don't know I'll have to fix that later I guess um, But if we ignore that and ignore the fact that for some reason my mouth has stopped moving, uh, mm, uh, okay, I don't know what's going on with, I don't, is it my webcam? Is it my mouth? Is it my, my model? I don't know. Uh, anyways, I have... A little bit of work news uh i'm still employed i have like i have a job interview friday i have a job interview monday and i have an interview possibly sometime later next week as well but i've still got to call the uh the one company that i interviewed with and they haven't called me back because that's honestly my first choice but I don't know. I don't know what to do except for just wait or if I have to start like talking to people that I know that know people that know things about stuff and people, I guess I will. This is really bothering me that my mouth isn't moving. Hold on. Hold on. Test. One, two. No. No. Okay. Hold on. Yeah. Still nothing. And it's like, it, it's really getting on my nerves that I haven't heard anything. Like, it's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. I now know that it is Wednesday. They can call me back. So tomorrow I'm going to call I'm going to aggressively call back and be like, "Hey, so I haven't heard anything." Uh and especially after I left a voicemail on Friday and on Monday, I would love to hear something, you know, just so like I I don't care if it's I don't care if it's a rejection. I just want just a just something as a like just a like just anything as like when you say we'll call you I expect a phone call I don't care if you're going to say yeah we picked somebody else I just want to know something like shit it's not that hard especially after I've called you twice So, I don't know, but I did get, um, I did get a call about a, about another job where, um, it would be seven days on seven days off with a two week, uh, a two week pay period. So I would work seven twelves and then I would have a week off, which sounds like it would be kind of fun, but also kind of dreadful. But it would be a night shift, so it wouldn't be too bad since I'm already in Night Goblin anyway. It would be 6P to 6A. So honestly, 
sounding kind of good right now. I mean, anything sounds good because I need money, but... And they consider that part-time, which is terrifying to know. Like, what? Huh? But at least they, like, hmm, I don't know. I wouldn't accrue any PTO, which would kind of suck if something happened in the middle of the, the week that I'm, uh, that I'm on. But, hmm, it works out, I guess. I don't know. We'll see how that one goes. That's gonna be a nightmare for my streaming schedule, because there won't be streams. It'll be, like, alternating... Okay, this week I'm going to stream, this week I'm not streaming, this week I'm streaming, this week I'm not. <sighs> so, we'll just have to see, I guess. Let's see. Ooh, this is four hours of Sinnoh music covers and arrangements by Insane in the Rain Music. Gonna turn it up just a little bit. Yeah! So... Life is progressing, and since content creation doesn't exactly pay the bills, has not paid a single bill in like a year. Yeah. But tomorrow's a just chatting stream. I'll complain more about uh, life and stuff tomorrow, and hopefully have some updates tomorrow. Tomorrow, we're just gonna like, tomorrow's just going to be a night where we just scream. Maybe like, if the, like if there's a topic we need to talk about, let's talk about it. If there's, um, if I just want to show y'all a meme, I can just open up my display capture and be like, ha ha, look, funny meme. Ha 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 ha. But yeah, let's just, let's just play some Pokemon. Or no, this isn't going to be Pokemon. Free, free cognition. It doesn't have Pokemon in the title. I think it's got, like, something adjacent to the word Pokemon in the title. I don't remember. I haven't looked at the thumbnail in a second. Oh, yeah, we played Desolation yesterday, so now everything's going to be completely cattywampus. So, hold on while I get that resized. Hey, DVD Gato. Welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good day. Oh. Did I leave the game muted? I left the game muted from when I went to the bathroom. Alright, let's continue. Kira, you're awake. My head. You passed out uh, and fell just after, yeah, just after I caught the Pokemon. The radio signal is XYZ. Yeah, okay, let's go. It's always, it's kind of hilarious that she, that, that's how she does that. Okay, so I need to catch, I need to catch a Rattata or Nicket with, um, Runaway first. And I looked it up from, oh my god, okay, get me out of here. Out of this battle with a Pikachu. I can't get away from anything. Oh my gosh, come on. This is why I need the Raticate? Radita? Radita. Hey, speak of the devil and the devil shall appear. Okay, so let's scratch. Oh my god, I'm on 3 HP. And I'm out of, I don't have any balls yet. Oh my god. Shortest run. Dead, deadest shortest run I've ever had. Fill me up, please, Tess. Anything else? I'm good. Alright. So I've got to find some Pokeballs first. 
But see, right here, I can jump over the... I remember yesterday, that being something that I brought up, is yesterday, I could jump over those wooden planks. But then, there's a place in a little bit that I can't jump over. And that just infuriated me, like, why, why are you doing this to me? Why can I not just jump over this innocuous spot that is very like very blatantly looking like I'm supposed to be able to jump over it. But what do I know? What do I know? Alright, I gotta turn the game down just a minute. Alright, Radita caught. Founder, ooh, a revival herb. That's huge. That is a huge. That is a huge yet. And we got a runaway Radita on the first go. Oh, yes. All right. This is huge. Okay. Started to call this a dead run. This is actually the best run so far. All right. So. What I did after stream to get ready for tonight. I went through a couple of other people who have played this game and I got some codes. So I know how to get through some of the major like doors that I need to get through. So this one is 4096. Cade said that he couldn't find the, the door code for this one. It's somewhere in the caves, but I don't remember where Tom found it. But Cade gave us this code. And I think it's somewhere down to my right. I think it's somewhere down there. I don't really remember. And then I got a couple of more a couple more door codes so we can we can get out of places or we can get through some places and um, I think let's see no I still it'll still make me go through a couple of spots where I've got a battle with the other parts of Bruble the other part of Bruble we've only had the one uh, the one encounter so far. Is that a spoiler that we've only been to one part? I guess not, since we already, like, it, it's in multiple pieces at this point. Go, eat to go. Thank you, Panda. Hope you're having a good day. Is that you sending me messages? Actually, no, it's not. Nope, but that's definitely a, a message I did not want to miss. Okay, might have to go unlock the door. Came home from dog watching. Oh yeah, you were you were talking about that last time. How uh, how goes how went the dog watching? How are those precious little furry babies? Haven't sent you any messages since you said you were streaming. Ah, okay, yeah. It was someone else. Okay. Let's open that. I mean, wait, I guess? Is this the... no? Okay. This one should be 1140. Yeah! And this will make life a whole lot easier. Oh, and there it is. If we if we had found it somewhere, I don't know how to how we were supposed to get here. They were a bit off. I think they noticed their brother was gone. Oh, is this oh, okay? So the direction the the way to get to the part of Bruble. If I had gone down and gone through this way, it would have led me to that that letter to know the way to get through the door. 
Okay, 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 okay. I see, I see. Okay. Perfect. And my friend that was messaging me a second ago has everything resolved, so that's perfect. And it's still here. Maybe I should try to catch it. Ooh, that's interesting. She mentions that because I do like so I need I do need to try to catch it because that this is grass type. Oh my god, I use that's a powerful ass mega drain. Oh golly. Okay, ingrain laser focus and bite oh no that's actually really bad oh this is really bad well this might be a dead run dead gummit Okay, I'm just gonna start throwing balls, cause... I've just gotta hope for the best. Uh, item... I've got a great ball. Come on, great ball, please! Catch it, please, 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 please catch it! No! I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble, I'm in trouble. Oh, thank goodness! I don't think it's gonna happen. Two, three. We got it! Yes! That's huge! That's huge! We get it! We got it! Found an ether. Huh? The Pokeball is gone. What's this? This orb. Perhaps Bruble should hold it. Bruble's Fear. A manifestation of Bruble's fear. It will change Bruble's second type to grass when held. Do I like dark VNs? Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Depends on what kind of dark. Playing a, a Gothis horror VN that's super neat. Definitely go ahead and link it to me, and I'll take a look at it. Because I'm going to be curious. It's just a demo, but it's neat. I like neat. I like things that are neat. I like things that are demos. I play. I tend to do that a lot here. Let's see, have I read this? Yeah, I think I have. Yeah. Okay, so I have one more passcode that I'll eventually be able to put in. But this is where I'm like, ah, fresh air sent. Thank you. Yeah, here we are. Ah, fresh air. It's so beautiful. It's so wonderful. I love it. Yes. Good. It has pretty boys and an NB. Ooh. You... That's that's where you get me right there. You can be NB or a boy. Panda, it's like you you know you know this the very specific things that I want in life. When it comes to some of these things, it's Sometimes I want to be NB, sometimes I want to be, uh, boy. Sometimes being NB sounds better, sometimes boy sounds better. Boy never, or not boy, girl never, never feels right though. Oh, I forgot, I, the music here is kind of creepy. I forgot the music's creepy. It's the NB senses, of course. Oh, it's naked! I'm gonna catch it. And hope that it has... 
I'm gonna hope it has um, Runaway as well, because it would be nice to have that extra. It would be nice to have an extra Runaway Pokemon just in case. Exactly, we are linked. Especially, I don't know what it is with people with birthdays around when you are, but especially just Libras in general. Just, I, I seem to have a connection with, ooh, that was a lot of damage. Ooh, oh, that's bad. Uh-oh. 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 Music low-key makes you think of the THX logo. <laughs> I see it. I hear it. Ooh. Ruble's a different color now. Ruble is slightly different now. It's got some blue... Oh! Like the blue... Oh, ooh. Neat. Okay. Ooh. Okay. I I do I seriously wish that um that I had a mo like in earlier versions of this game from what I've seen different versions of uh or like lower level versions of Bruble have um Lower level versions of Bruble get um, an attack that's like base 100, 100 accuracy that um, that does like real like really good damage and has like does extra based off of whatever my secondary type is. So since I'm grass type right now, it would be a 100, 100 grass move like earthquake, but grass and nick it has run away. I'm getting really lucky this run and I'm very happy. Very, very happy and very excited. Don't want to go there yet. I need to find the house with the healer. Healer machine. Please and thank you. I think it's this up here. Muck. Wait, is... I'm just having a moment where I don't remember. Is Muck in, um... Are Muck and Grimer in Scarlet and Violet? Yeah, they are. I'm like 80% sure they are. Yep, the first darn scene is Tauros versus a Muck. I like using Muck. I'm not like, I'm not the biggest fan of most poison types, but Muck is one of the exceptions. Like Muck and uh, especially Alolan Muck. I think Alolan Muck is really cool. Okay, now I, wait. How are my pockets? Uh, hold on, we're gonna do a little bit of exploring for the sake of I know where I'm going. And I really want to have more Pokeballs because I need I need more Pokeballs for the catches. Okay, two more Great Balls. Uh, I'm feeling a little more confident now. I'm feeling a little more confident. But I think there's somewhere I can get more? I don't know. Let's see, wasn't there something beside the hospital? You have a few exceptions too, like Scolipede, Toxtricity, and of course Revivroom. Exactly. There's always the like one or two exceptions that you can, you can have. Like poison types, don't really care for them, but I've got a couple. There's a couple of exceptions couple of babies that that are exactly that babies there we go two ultra balls 
Now I'm ready. Also, is this the part where I need a coughing? If it is, I need to hurry up and find a coughing. Please, coughing with neutralizing gas. No, you're a muck. I wish I had liked, um... Galarian Weezing. I wish I had liked it more. But... Eh. It just didn't work out. I didn't end up liking it as much as I wanted to. Okay, I've seen that one. I don't remember. Is there anything in these? No. 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 Okay. And I don't think there was anything in the other ones either. Okay. Had to reply. Had to reply because there's someone in my house. And that's a weird thing to say because I live alone, but <laughs> I have a friend in my house, they have a key, and they are resting because they were walking home and were like, uh, I'm not going to make it home, I'm going to die. Can I stop at your house? I said, absolutely, you've got a key, just walk, just let yourself in. Just know that I'm streaming because uh, that would be really funny and scary if suddenly, oh, there's someone in my house and I'm streaming, oh shit. I don't I don't need any, any of that kind of excitement not today I'm too I'm too low energy for that stuff like what do you mean there's somebody in my house I live alone it's me and two cats like occasionally Gus will come over but that's it but occasionally this friend will also come over so Okay. These... Someone in my house. <laughs> they got a DM. <laughs> they hear me. <laughs> but you are someone in my house. I can hear them laughing. Okay. I don't... I think it's this way? Yeah. You would be the friend that would just show up. You don't have a key, but you'd find a way. I mean, you always can. And you won't be turned away. Are you... Are you a part of Bruble too? Another part of Bruble. This thing looks even creepier. Um, let's go for nasty plot. Oh, ooh, that did over half. I might be in trouble. Oh, it's going for will o wisp. Now I'm burned. Oh, that was perfect. Perfect damage. Perfect. Perfect. You approve of it? You love it? It's a good boy. It's part of Bruble, of course it's perfect, it's beautiful, it's wonderful, it's magnificent, it's Bruble! You wanna hug it and give it smooches? <laughs> it is a... I mean, it's part of Bruble, so of course it's a good boy. Good... Whatever Bruble is. Uh, let's swap into Ratata. Ratata, 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 Ratata. Haha, -ha, Phantom Force, it does nothing to me. Uh, ooh, okay. That was almost bad. Let's throw another Great Ball! One, two, three. Yeah, there we go. We got part of another part of Brubel. Found an elixir. Another one of those items. Alright, so what is this one? 
Ruble's loss. It will change Ruble's second type to the to ghost when held. Ooh, nice. Quick blind. All right, new content. Someone has checked in at the Lowesdale Hospital with symptoms of W. Fell Spore Syndrome. No possibility of an outbreak as of yet, but we'll keep our, uh, our eye on it. January 10. Three more people have checked in with symptoms of W. Fell Spore Syndrome. February 15th. The number of presumed W. Fell Spore Syndrome cases has surpassed 100. Lowesdale Hospital is rapidly filling up with patients presenting with symptoms for W. Fell Spore Syndrome. Lowesdale Hospital is at capacity. Majority of patients are presumed to have W. Fell Spore Syndrome. Health Service is having to convert residential buildings into makeshift hospitals just to keep the infected away from everyone else. The government has declared martial law. Lowesdale is being forcefully evacuated. Ooh. Ominous. Okay, I think... Yeah! Okay, that's actually, like, a really big door that I just opened. But we're, we're, we, we gotta do some more lore learning first before we go through that, before we actually go through that door. I gotta heal up first, though, because Mom's about to see. Okay. Okay, where is, where's my healies? I need to get heals, please. Where did it go? There it is. Oh, this music still creeps me out. I wish there was just like the tiniest bit of, um, just the tiniest bit of like, calm upbeat music at any point in this game but i know that's asking too much especially because this game is supposed to keep that that eerie feeling and i love it i hate it i love it i hate it it's so good it's irritating <laughs> no ir irritating is the wrong word irritating is the wrong word it is draining no I want a little bit of variety when it comes to games. Like I want to have, I want to feel that little bit of like, I want to. <laughs> Loadstale incident speculations. Loadstale incident conclusion. Door code for idiots who forgot it. Criminal activity has seen an increase in both violent and nonviolent crime by forty five percent. It is unknown if this is due to. W spore W fell spore syndrome or large scale um whoa oh large scale collapse of law enforcement in the area most of what can be confirmed is increased reports of psychosis testimonials making repeated reference to a type of precognition delusion exactly the same as reported in the case of Jack Friedman before their ultimate uh untimely death uh this is definitely a step in the right direction Oh, our analysis of this outbreak has been rather conclusive. It seems with the right conditions, we could harness these W, w fell spores and their unique properties. And then door code for idiots who forgot it. I cannot believe I have to write this for the 10th time. The door code for the duck building or for the duck blind is five, four, eight, seven. Stop calling me to ask for the code. You should know we're not supposed to openly talk about this place. Well, so that's how I was supposed to know that code. Which works for me as long as I can get the code. 
Especially if I can show where I'm getting these codes from, that's even better. Oops. Okay. So now, I don't... This is where I don't know what's going on anymore. To Lowsdale, Duck Blind. Ooh. A for MB autopsy. Probably shouldn't open this. Probably shouldn't open this. Or this. Or this. Or this. Ah. Uh, nope, not allowed to open any of the autopsy, uh, autopsied bodies. Med bay cold storage. Ah, that would explain some things. Med bay operating theater. Ooh. I'm here to... Hold on. I'm not here to judge yet. Hold on. Hold on. We gotta do this right. We gotta do this right. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Alright. Bring it on. Perfect. There we go. Now I'm here to judge. I am here to judge the hell out of this game. You, you want to have some medical inaccuracies? Bring it on. I will roast the hell out of you if you're going to have some medical inaccuracies. Bring it on. Nah, I'm not going to roast you too hard. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Come on. Give me free stuff. Notes slash speculation on low steel situation. Chief Surgeon Annette uh, DuPont. Chief Medical Practitioner Carl Stark. Patient details. Patient name Jack Friedman. Date of birth May 21st, 1971. Height and weight. Blood type. Current status. Unresponsive catatonic infection induced coma. Admittance date April 23rd, 1998. Observations. Blue-green growth coating body, slow respiration, low body temperatures, cell from plant structures chemically bonded with native cells, numerous basidious structures along uh, the former abdomen, neural activity on, on average with other coma patients. You, you know the color shampoo you ordered? You might get it super soon. Wouldn't be surprised if it arrives on Friday. Oh, nice! Heck yeah. What is... What is Basidia? Oh, okay. So Basidia is the plural of... Let's see. Do I still have that Speak It plugin? No. Uh, a basidium is a microsop microscopic spore producing structure found on the hymen four of fruiting bodies of fungi, a sp specific kind of fungi, uh, which are also called tertiary, tertiary mycelium, developed from secondary mycelium. Tertiary mycelium is a highly coiled secondary mycelium. The presence of basidia is one of the main character characteristic features of a basidio uh, my, mycota. A basidium usually bears four sexual spores called basidiospores. Occasionally, the number may be two or even eight. In a typical basidium, each basidiospore is is born at the tip of a narrow prong or horn called a stergema and is forcibly dis discharged upon maturity. Huh. Damn. They did some good research using some really good fancy big words like this. I love it. Holy shit, that's good. This is good. Like, 
after after we finish this game, I am like I am sending the dev just a DM that just says I love you. Or we just need to clip this and and let them know I love you. You're not like some of these game devs that will get a defibrillator on a on a patient that's not dying. Uh, you don't do any basic CPR. You're like, it's time to get the defibrillator. What did you miss? Uh, me getting to where I'm in love with the developer of this game because they did some basic research for this game and are using some words that, um, some, some good science words. Experiment Gamma 1.1, author Simon Lee. Since the incident with Jack Friedman in the caves, the board of directors has been very interested in repeating the effects of spore exposure. They have tasked me with creating the same effect. However, they have uh, they have cruelly and rather ignorantly barred me from using live human test subjects. While this is very much annoying, it is still workable. We have taken some very willing volunteers, extracted a minute amount of genetic structure, and cloned it for testing. The testing will include exposure of the cloned meat to repeated concentrated spore blasts over the coming months. Oh, don't like that. Results from repeated exposure are less than hoped. Little growth has occurred on the cloned cells. The plant cells seem reluctant to fuse with those clones uh, from the volunteers, reasons to which are currently unknown. We are looking into it and should hopefully have a solution soon. I wonder if this is, like, more on the parasitic side. Like, kind of like, is it The Last of Us that has the, like, the parasite fungus stuff? Is it The Last of Us? Uh, I'm gonna have to look. Oh, I don't want to do this. I really don't want to, because I think... If I remember correctly... Yep, 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 yep. Oh, 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 okay. The last I I looked up the last of the zombies and I forgot that they actually give me like the creeps. You find it funny that because of that game, it made people too freaked out when it comes to eating mushrooms. I don't blame people when they're like, mushrooms freak me out. And they're, um, and they're like, I, especially, I can understand like it being a texture thing, but especially like because mushrooms are a fungus, I understand. Like that's a good, that's a, I understand. But uh, oh, that game, that game, uh, oh, oh. Like it, it, it causes a, an actual visceral reaction, and I hate it. And especially, I've had enough visceral reactions this month. Uh, I'm good, thank you. On the fourth attempt, we still got little, a uh, little more growth, but still not enough. Uh, we even tried it in the cave to no avail. We looked over Jack's medical reports to see if they had anything of use. Nothing. There is no earthly expla explanation why it's not working. You can call them ex you can you can say they're hella cool. I say that they give me the freaking creeps. We've tried everything. Nothing. Uh, the only conclusion I can draw is that a lingering brain is required to uh, replicate the incident that led to Jack's uh, prophetic psychosis and untimely demise. This means we have no choice but to switch to human testing, but the board just won't allow it. Too dangerous, they say. I've sent several requests to the board to allow me to source from an out-of-state prison for test subjects, and they have repeatedly refused. I just don't see another way of this experiment succeeding. I'll make sure the samples are kept preserved here just in case, but I'm not holding out hope. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Wait a minute. Prophetic.
guys. The intimidation was a failure, and now the Herman family is threatening to involve the police. The legal fees from this would potential, uh, and the potential investigation into our actions could destroy the whole company. Our most efficient opinion uh, to avoid this would be to directly remove them from the property they are squatting in and bring them here to be dealt with accordingly. Thanks to their extremely isolated lifestyle, we would not have to worry about any family members raising suspicion at their sudden and permanent disappearance. Oh no. Oh no. Hold on, I'm going to go back down first. Because I think I missed something. Yeah. Okay, just some water. What's this? Uh oh hold on where's my pen where's my pen it's not on my chest because i'm not wearing scrub shirt here we go four four three five five six whatever the heck that means because that's a series of numbers i don't have written down so that means it's definitely important and I don't know what it is. Okay, that's... Oh, no. Fizz Lab dorms. Oh, this will be good. This will be bad. Oh, this music is too creepy. Th Ooh, three hyper potions. Nice. Nothing in here. And nothing on the computer. Doors locked. Three more hyper potions. Nothing in here. Nothing in here. There are no. Oh, wait. The beds are like in the wall. Don't know how I feel about that. And door is locked. Well, I got hyper potions from the room that visibly mattered. Oh no, biolab dorms. Okay. Nothing. Oh. Ooh. Archive from 717 of 06. Uh, we have detected trace amounts of WFL spores in the Lowsdale water supply pipeline. Not sure how or when it started, but for all we know, these spores could have been in the water for years. I believe this is quite an important research opportunity, uh, as we could study the long-term effects of small quantities of the spores ingested over a long period of time on a massive scale. Oh, no. Get lost, phone. Uh oh, I just swiped away a notification that I didn't see. Okay, it was something that wasn't even important. Okay. The directors agree that this is a great opportunity. This is also a great opportunity. Uh, they also believe an external in, uh, investigative process into how the leak occurred would negatively, negatively impact our research and potentially open us up to legal ramifications if it is discovered the leak is a fault of ours. Uh, we will not be disclosing the leak or our plans to the local authorities. The company has purchased buildings around the center of Lowsdale from inside, which you should be able to closely monitor the city and its inhabitants without arousing suspicion. 2009. The Board of Directors has reviewed your proposal for Experiment Delta. Wait, no. Are we, are we looking for Zeta? I think we're looking for Experiment Zeta. So this is Experiment Delta. So we're getting there. They agree that the progress on... Reports from Gamma are slower than uh, required, and that investigation into the spores' effects on Lowsdale is yielding little useful information. However, the board has also shown repeated concerns of potential legal and PR repercussions. The proposed plan 
could entail if not executed perfectly. With this in mind, they have decided to approve your proposal for increasing spore count per milliliter uh, released into Lowsdale's water supply, while also implementing extensive measures to ensure that if the experiment is made known to the general public, you will be the only one legal legally culpable with a paper trail leading them to the natural conclusion that you acted outside the company's best interest. Ooh. Oh, no, I didn't want to leave. I didn't want to leave. Go back, go back, go back. Ah! Tess? Wait. I know that. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Tess. We know Tess. We know a Tess. Hold on, that's not a coincidence. That's not a coincidence. That's how we... That's how we're... And she's a botanist. Bruh. Oh my god, I'm having, the, I'm having these good brain tingles. That's such a good, really tiny detail, because none of the other ones you can access. You can't read the rest of them, so you wouldn't think to look at them. You wouldn't think to look at this one, because all the rest of them from the last one, and so far this one, this is the only one that has a name on it. Tess Capricorn, the botanist on the plane that somehow crashed before we could get to Delta, or b b before we got to Zeta. And now I'm starting to have some of these symptoms. Hello? Is someone out there? Uh, yes. Oh, thank the Lord. Ever since experiment, experiment Zeta 07 breach containment, the lab's been on maximum lockdown. Now me and a dozen other scientists are trapped inside this room. You need to get back to the containment cell and get it back under control. Right, okay. I guess that's what I came here to do in the first place. Uh, the door is locked, but the door is also gone. Uh, uh-oh. Uh-oh. Hey, who are you? I'm behavior expert, they sent. Oh, Kira, right? You're out of luck, I'm afraid. Ever since it went berserk, that door's been jammed shut. Nothing we could, uh, nothing we do could get it open. Starting to think it might be good something to, uh, might be doing something to keep it shut. Sorry to disappoint you. You may as well wait around here. It's not safe to be wandering around. Someone needs to get to it. I think I can get the door open. Ha, <laughs> you think? You can try. There's no way you're opening that door. Oh, no. Experiment Epsilon 01, author Simon Lee, March 4th, 2013. What Delta has quite obviously proven, and what many colleagues uh, continue to ignore, is that the human brain is not capable of creating stable symbiosis with the spores. What seems dear to me is that the best way to utilize the properties of the spores is to merge them with living Pokemon. Now, after my uh, work on Gamma, this absolutely has to work. I can't have another failure under my belt, and, but I'm certain this line of experience will lead to results. It has to. Author Simon Lee, March 9, 2013. The company has allocated me a litter of Eevees selected because of their unique... Uh, enigmatic abilities and the potential interaction that uh, that that may have with the spores. The Eevees shall be fed the spores diluted into their drinking water as that seems to be the most effective way to introduce spores into a living organism. Hey, that wasn't there before. A 
series of behavioral changes have been observed within the test subjects over the course of the experimentation becoming a lot more energetic and aggressive, as well as the ability to uh, almost see danger before it happens. What a weapon they would make. Several colonies have been found along the stomach and throats of some of the test subjects. While functioning similarly to an elemental stone like I'd hoped, the progress of the spore growth and overall health of the subjects has proven my hypothesis correct. It's already looking looking up for for old Simon. Hey Cade, welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good day. Um we're we've learned a lot. Like holy heck have we learned a lot. Like I, I'm not shitting my pants, but I'm damn close to shitting my pants. Oh, this is by author Lily Fitzgerald. April 3rd, 2013. Cleaning up what Professor Lee left behind was harrowing, to say the least. What we found here wasn't moral. It's clear that Evie's genetic makeup, while being able to sustain the abilities of the spore for a period of weeks, just isn't enough to keep it together. Putting that behind me, the board has dictated I shall now be in charge of Epsilon. Now, uh, not exactly how I saw my career going, but here I am. Ooh, the Lord does go hard, especially there was there was just one way to see that it was Tess. That was the scientist that had gone just a little too far and was going to take a lot of the heat if something went wrong. And like, and then a lot of things clicked, especially when we were all we also found out that some of the precognition stuff that we're having is part of the effects of the spores. And then we see that Tess is the one that's responsible. So it's like, wait, we've been, she's examining us. We're supposed to be examining Zeta, but she is examining us. Ah, it's so good. All right. Experiment Epsilon 02, Lily Fitzgerald. This morning I received a hitter of... A litter of Eevees in my office. I'm baffled by this uh, utter display of either pure malice or incompetence. Simon's test already proved uh, that the Eevee genetic makeup, uh, much like humans, cannot sustain a colony of the plant structures. Doing it again is just cruel. Tess Capricorn, April 29th, 2013. With the new selection of Eevees, we have begun the second attempt. Uh, we have altering concentration in their water to make the growth uh, from within more gradual. Tess Capricorn, January 5th, 2014. After the fifth attempt, it is plain to see that the Eevee's genetic makeup is not adaptive enough to sustain concentrated plant colonies. It seems that growth from within has a random factor um, that, tear, that tears cell structures apart. Perhaps if we introduce the spore while, while it gestates within an egg, the makeup of the subject will be more malleable and willing to work in synergy with the plant structures. Oh no, they're fucking with the eggs. The last batch of six EV eggs during gestation, we have given them daily five open injections of of something spore mixture shown to be the most substantially potent. Uh, growth within these eggs has slow uh, has already shown great deviation from the control group. Ooh. February 4th. 
the equipment giving us readings on the eggs broke today. So of course we fixed it and we discovered that the readings from the egg within the new equipment are different. They're not even close. So we decided to turn the sensor on and off multiple times and we got a wide variety of vastly different readings. My theory is that the contents within the egg exist something within some kind of qu uh, quantum superposition. I'm elated with how this project is going and the eggs haven't even hatched yet. This morning, around, around 0800 hours, the first few eggs began to hatch, more specifically three of the eight subjects. Two of these, uh, two of three were resounding failures, resulting in vicious black liquid. However, lucky number three was more, pr uh, was a more promising failure. The third subject was a strange fractal plant structure feeding into itself, rejecting its own reality. It refrained, uh, it remained stable for approximately nine hours before finally collapsing in on itself and leaving no physical trace of its existence. This is extremely promising. I feel I feel Simon was flawed in his selection of Pokemon. Now, now that we know what we're dealing with, structure of infinite potentials, and uh and Evie's genetic makeup simply can't account for that. Oh no. I've spent the last week working with the lovely Sophie Newitt, trying to ascertain potential. A potential Pokemon to reconduct the experiment, and we think we've landed on the perfect specimen. Ditto. Ditto has the genetic potential to imitate any Pokemon. Like, seriously, how and why did we not think of this sooner? <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong to think, why didn't we think of this sooner? But also, uh, you were already thinking about genetic, like, isn't Eevee considered, like, the genetic Pokemon in the first place? So, I guess that kind of makes sense. Hold on, let me look up Eevee. What is it called? Oh, the evolution Pokemon. But then all of its Pokedex entries are like, yeah, it's genetically unstable, and that's what makes it be able to evolve into, like, a different Pokemon. Funnily enough, I never noticed that Ditto is 132, and then Eevee is 133. It's right before Eevee in the Pokedex. Huh. There you go, fan theorist. Why aren't we talking about that? How Ditto, the genetically unstable, or the genetically everything Pokemon, is, um, is also right in front of Eevee, the genetically crazy, unstable Pokemon. Like, why don't we talk about that? That's something that might, like, that that's a little sus right there they they put pokemon that are like each other right there beside each other i'm also gonna put on some music because it's kind of quiet i spent the last week working with the lovely sophie knew it trying to ascertain oh ditto why haven't we tried this sooner uh we have Reset the experiment to identical condition uh, conditions as attempt one to see if this works any better. We got our first set of hatches today. No success. The resulting specimens were completely formless. We're going to try again. We're gonna try again a Singa. Is that supposed to be as greater concentration spores? Oh, using a. All right, Zeta O five. It seems we have inc uh, we may have increased the concentration too much. Our next batches were incomprehensible. Drove the two lab techs nearest to the eggs insane. 
We managed to subdue them before they did any damage to the specimens, but unfortunately, this batch will need to be disposed of. Zeta-06 our, our efforts have paid off. We have successfully fused a Pokémon with the spores. The specimen defies the laws of physics we know them, as we know them, existing in multiple states at once. You can look at it, and it's almost angelic beams of light emanating from a great, a great form. You blink, and it's gone in its place. A small, skitty-like thing, the next, the next something impossible to even imagine. Naturally, this phenomenon is beyond my area of expertise, so we've brought it. Uh, we've brought in Richard from the physics team to take a look. Experiment Zeta Seven. With the help of Richard's observations, analysis, and guidance, we have managed to tame the specimens superposition. It now exists in one constant form while retaining its unique abilities. Richard speculates that it won't be stable, and that it may be under extreme strain split into multiple forms. He says it has uh, it has been put What the heck? I wasn't expecting that one, but okay. Thanks, background music. He said it's been put through a great deal of pain and that we should be cautious with our experiments. I'm eager to learn more about its abilities. I'm excited to see how much it'll take to break this thing. Experiment Zeta-7. Zeta-7 uh, shock, st shock stimulation test 114 subject remains uh neuro oh unrespond those look like the same letters except for like one pixel off and it's hard to read it in the first place that's one thing i wish for this game is that the these letters were a little bit easier to read or there was like more of these had a way to read them separately especially when you get to the bottom and there's that shine over the where it's been laminated that's a little hard to read. So, shock simulation test 114 subjects remains unresponsive after multiple shocks of upwards of 6,600 volts. Yeah, that's kind of what I'm starting to wonder. Are we Zeta 07 or are we just another test subject or what are we? Because we, I don't know. We're definitely some kind of test subject here. And it's getting, it's, it's got me nervous and excited. The subject remained alive and, um, and from what we can, t uh, can, what we can tell, uh, conscious, uh, we have so much, we have yet to elicit in, Enlicit a reaction from the subject uh, using shock stimulation, more study needed. We have white hair, we're a tragic anime character. Oh my god, we are. Oh my god, we are a tragic anime, white, anime character with white hair. This is why I'm glad I now have gray hair. I can be a tragic anime, hair, anime character with gray hair and I don't have to worry about dying. It also explains why they keep sending you to dangerous places. <gasps> oh shit, Panda. Oh shit. You actually might be right. We're the most expendable foot. Because we're just another subject. Oh no. We got our first reaction from the subject today when we tried to remove the carapace along its back. It screamed. Its wail of agony were a beautiful harmony. If we fail to turn this into a weapon, it'll make a wonderful instrument. What? I don't like that. It's time to- Honestly, it is. With the kind of bullshit kind of experiment she's been putting onto these- Onto these creatures. 
It is time to duke it out with Tess. Oh, April 11, 2025. Zeta 07 attacked a lab tech today. He was rushed to the med lab immediately, but I can't say I'm optimistic for him. I'm excited to see how powerful Zeta 07 can become, but for now we need to find a way to calm it down, get it to heal. Cooper uh, corporate agrees. In fact, they've done my my job for me and contacted someone to come and take a look. Some Galarian behavior researcher by the name Kira Thornton. Okay, that's us. So, we're not Zeta 07. Zeta 07 is not us. That confirms that we are not them. Richard and I will be going, uh, going with Rain from corporate to pick her up and bring her here next week. Until then, we're keeping Zeta 07 uh, restrained as best as possible. It's June! When we first started, it was June! So yeah, we've been poisoned. Either we've been poisoned, or we've been consumed or something. Oh, no. When am I? Man, I wish I had my voice changer working, because that would have been fun to hit a button on the stream deck and be like, when am I? <laughs> it did have ditto, but what? who's to say ditto can't turn to look human? That is true. I mean, we know- I remember Zoroark was able to, in Zoroa. I don't remember if Ditto can or not, but I don't see why they wouldn't be able to. But interesting, when am I? Not where, not what, when. It's so cold. I don't understand. Oh, that's a door. Pain, 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 pain. This music's too damn happy. Oh no, oh no. Oh no. Bruble? The door is held shut by an otherworldly force. Let's look at Brubel. Okay, everything's the same. Oh, what? What? Okay. Oh, no. That's that's what I'm starting to think is that Bruble is Zeta 007. Oh. Okay, there's a cave. Bruble? It's okay. I won't hurt you. Don't be afraid. Oh. Brubel. You pet Brubel. All right, Brubel's back with us, I guess. Our little buddy.
And then where's... Where's the other one? Nope. That's just looking pretty. Okay. Oh, poor Bruble. I think Bruble is 007. Gotta find the third one. Poor baby deserves better than this. And he's such a cute little guy. Hmm. But where is... I am at the ending part, and I'm so nervous. Oh my gosh, I'm like... We've learned so much and I want to, I want to take, I, I, I want Tess to have a very nice looking necklace. So I'm going to go paint my nails later so she can have a very nice necklace. I think that's the best way I've ever heard of anyone saying I'm going to choke someone out. It's, I'm getting my nails painted, so when I choke you out, you've got a beautiful necklace. <laughs> oh. <gasps> oh. Oh, no. Oh, are there more? Are there two more that I didn't find? I only found two. Is there four of them? I'm sorry for what they did to you, the city. Just got your nails done earlier. You want to help pick her necklace too? Hey, all right. Are you Zeta07? Are you a part of Bruble too? 2014, I agree. All that it is... All that was, all that will be, 2025. Something before I am selected and if bound. Um, hello? Oh no. Alrighty. Let's go for a nasty plot. Uh, Snarl, future sight, but it failed. All right. Oh. Oh, no. Um. Oh no. Future Sight, Fury Swipe, missed. Of course it missed. Bite, I guess? Oh, good mercy, why? Ah, hoo! 4 HP! Future Sight? Yep, that's gonna hurt in a minute. I wish I had, um, I wish I had the move that, um, I saw that Tom had the move, the, the, the base 100, 100 accuracy move that was based off of your secondary type. I wish I had that. Let's see. I already used my revival herb. 
Yep. Uh, laser focus. Precognition. Oh, that's actually fine then. Did I delete the move? No, I never got the move. When I started the game, I didn't get, um, I didn't get the move. Uh, I didn't get the, the 100 base, the 100 attack move. I guess it was edited in an update because I, like, it started me at level 20. Because I remember, like, I saw that you, I saw that you had it, Tom, but then I did, I haven't had it. I'm just going to have to keep going for, I'm going to have to just keep alternating between using Bite and Protect. So, laser focus. Bite. No, it set up future sight. Laser focus. Setting up future sight again. Laser focus. Bite. Ah! No, is that gonna. No! Ooh, but now I can ask Tess more questions. I found an item that changes Bruble's type. Fascinating. After all of this is done with, maybe we could take a look at its abilities a bit more in a in a more scientific setting. Uh, sure. Anything else? I think Bruble might be a part of a larger Pokemon. What? I've seen things that look sort of like it. They communicated like family. Like they were one and the same deep down. You must be imagining things. Unless... No, that can't possibly be right. Could it? Could... What? It doesn't matter. Anything else? It's a Pokemon we created a few years ago. I'm not really sure how much I'm allowed to tell you. Sorry. Okay. Uh, yeah, since I'm this close, I might as well ask if there's any good tips for beating beating the boss, since, um, it's looking like Radita and Nickit, as fantastic as they did, uh, I have a feeling I'm gonna need something a little more substantial. Because Bite wasn't doing super effective damage, which was unfortunate because I was hoping I was hoping it would be a psychic type like Ruble, which apparently it is not. So I will gladly take um, pointers, any like specific Pokemon I need to be catching, anything like that, because uh, it's not looking that great. I don't trust. I don't trust my ability to beat it with uh, the Pokemon that I have. Get the runaway Pokemon, but in the city you can catch a Haunter, which has... Oh! Okay, I getcha, I getcha, I see. Okay. Lead off with Haunter while it sets up whatever weird move it's going to use. We got Rattata, good. Please. No, it's guts. Might be good for that other battle, though. No. Well, yeah, maybe. Yeah, not getting outraged. Def I mean, it was like turn two or something. I, I had enough time to set up a nasty plot and go for Snarl, which was nice. Pretty sure the boss has a second form, and I've heard you can catch the second form, but if you have a good team, you may as well fight it anyway. Noted, noted. Let's see, I need more Pokeballs.
because catching uh, catching Radita was not successful enough. Uh, you don't think so about the the second form? Uh, are there are there other forms that I've missed? Because there were six beds and only uh, I've only, and only three of them were being used. So I'm taking it. It's Brubel and then Ghost and then Grass. No, that's what you got too? Okay. Okay. Now I've got some more items so we can try and catch a Radita. There were four beds when you. Ooh. Hmm. Then I've missed something. If you had four beds that were full, because I only had three. Don't do this to me, you stinking Pikachu. I love you. I love Pikachu, but not right now. I don't want to do this. Oh, you don't remember? Okay. Don't remember, but you think it was four. Gotcha, gotcha. Can't get away. Of course. Well, that's what I've got Radita for. If I can find a freaking Radita or a Nicket, like I've been trying to do, like having, when, like, catching a Nicket? Oh my god, yes. That's perfect for what I need. Because apparently the, the psychic move, all the psychic moves, I can just be immune to. Bite, we'll go for bite. And item, throw a Pokeball. One, two, three. There we go. Please, please have run away. Please let me win this coin toss. Pokemon, summary. Run away, thank goodness. Okay. Who knows, maybe having an extra Radita will be useful. Or something. I don't know. Heal me up. And I'm good. So we are not Zeta007. That is clear. And Tess is a bunch of bad words that I'm not allowed to say on YouTube. Okay, so 4096. Click. Oh. Okay, that was my that was my headset doing something weird. My battery's low. Granted, my the battery on my on my headphones lasts a really long time, and I'm very, very happy about that every time I think about it, because it it lasts like I don't think I've had to charge them in like a week or two. And I use them on top like in a like when I'm not even when I'm not streaming. So these headphones have a really good battery life. But it gets annoying when I forget to charge them and it's like, oh, right. You never need a charge. That's why I never remember to charge you because most of the time they're just good. Okay, flip that switch. And thankfully, when I put in 1140, I get to go this way and I can go fight. Or no, I can just beat up this Bruble. Now that I've got... Oh, 
No! I hit the wrong button. I was supposed to... Ah... Uh... Ah, uh, no, I was trying to... I was trying to go to my pockets. I have fear and loss. Ah, oh, that's okay. We weren't far. We weren't far. But I think I am going to give Bruble that, so it'll be part ghost type. But yeah, it works in what uh, the the codes seem to work. All of the codes so far that I, I snagged all of the codes that I could from Tom. I went through Tom's playthrough. He had uploaded them to YouTube. I'm like writing this down because I know I'll need it. Thankfully, I've been able to use them. Okay. Now I've got balls. Let's try to catch a Radita with Runaway. Oh, I'm so angry at myself. Well. Uh, bite. Bite. Laser focus. Do one more bite. Please don't hit me too hard. Oh, you're gonna go for another laser focus. Sure. Pa yeah, the past. I I saw what you went through, Tom, and I'm just. Oh, good God. I'm so glad. I'm so glad I didn't go through that. <laughs> and found a leper berry. Nice. And it's holding a Chylandary. Nice. With the Runaway! Nice. Okay. So we've got Runaway. Let's get healed. You never found the Pokemon Center in the city or realized that Tessa can heal you? Oh no, you played on super hard mode. That was one of the first things I made sure to learn was that they're like I could heal with Tessa. And then I'm thankful that Cade was able to point me toward uh toward the healing station in the in the town, but oh no. I can't imagine going through it without knowing that. All right. So this is 4096. And how many Pokeballs do I have? Two. I'll pick up a third one. Wait, I don't need to I don't need to catch uh I don't need to catch it anymore. I can defeat it. Now that I've now that I've gotten the fear and other feeling that I've forgotten. Healing wild Pokemon give you healing items, so I thought that you had to get lucky with that Oh no, that's terrible. I mean, I understand where, like, where that thought process is because, it, like, the, there, there is a lot of lack of clarity that I wish this game would would do. I wish there was a little bit more clarity with some of that stuff, but I understand at the same time. Okay, flip the switch. Door code one one four zero. And we're back to Bruble. Let's grab this Pokeball. So we've got th three Pokeballs. Hopefully that'll that'll help us get to. Hopefully that'll help us get Haunter, I guess. But oh man, see this is part of oh. It's just gone. Okay. Well, shoot, that makes life easier. I don't have to worry about 
about rebattling um rebattling since since I ca I caught him I guess so that's convenient uh oh okay we're good stream don't do that to me not today I'm glad that I don't have to fight bosses after I've beaten them because I'd be in trouble. Okay, and... Alright, we're in the town. So we need to catch a haunter. Ooh, Bennett. Does Bennett know curse? Let's find out. Pain split. Flinched and couldn't move. Ah, uh, no, let's just bite it. Since I know Haunter will have Curse opposed to Vinette, which I don't know if it'll have Curse. And picking up some Pokeballs while I'm in the city because I'll need them. There's a Haunter, there we go. All right, let's go ahead and let's throw a YOLO ball. Come on. Nope, okay, we gotta, we gotta weaken it just a little bit. Hypnosis. Hypnosis. <laughs> All right, throw another great ball. One, two, three. No, come on. I mean, look. Uh, all right. You want me to stay. I understand. I will stay. I will gladly stay here with you, Haunter. You don't have to. You don't have to give me the mean look. You just have to say pretty please, or you can just get in the ball. We can be friends that way. One, two, three. See. Now we can be friends. We didn't have to do anything weird. And we found a Lepiberry. Please tell me Haunter has Curse. With Levitate, Hypno- Oh, you've got to be over a certain level. Oh no, okay. Um, Let's look up Haunter then. H-A-U-N-T-E-R. Control F C C U R S E. Learns it at level twenty. Gotta go, but, uh, but good luck. Thank you, Tom. Thanks for stopping by. Hope you have a good night. Sleep tight. Or good day. I don't know what time it is for you. Time is a myth. So, yeah, Haunter, Haunter learns Curse at level 20. So, of course, I had to get the one Haunter that's level 19. <laughs> uh, that's okay. That's okay. It does mean I need to hurry up and heal, so that way I can go ahead and get on with things. Let's see. There's the healing spot. So I've got to look for another Haunter, which is always my luck. Yeah, it shouldn't be too bad. Alright, let's heal the party. And I guess let's keep running around. I know there's a couple of places where I can pick up some more balls, like that one right there. So we can keep running around trying to get another Haunter, which won't be, shouldn't be a problem. I think I'm, hey, that one's level 24. Catch a few others so I can guarantee a win. Okay, good to know, good to know, good to know. Let's go for a bite. 
Hey, this one's got... Oh, no, wait. Oh! Okay. 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 Throw the only... I only have one great ball. I only have one great ball. Haunter, you better get in this freaking ball. You better get in the ball. One, two, three. Caught. Oh, that was too close. And a citrus berry. <laughs> oh, that's great. We got an evolution. <laughs> No, I'm not actually ending the stream. That was just the only button I could click. Because for some reason I forgot to put in... I forgot to put a thing down for me to put my BRB. The game crashed because I leveled up. And because I evolved into Raticate. It didn't close. Hold on, let's go back. I mean, it says an error has occurred and precognition has been forced to shut down. Let's see. There we go. I hit X and it shut down. This is why we can't have good things. So, word word to the wise. Don't uh don't let your ratata evolve. Especially if you're in the middle of a good run. It be like that, but it don't make me feel better that it be like that. I understand this is a game in beta. I understand that this is a game that's in beta. I understand that this is a game that's in beta. That is true, at least it wasn't my computer that went into blue screen. But I'm still grumpy. Yeah, don't level up. No level ups. Don't do anything to become too powerful. Did... Wow! I hate this game. I hate this game. I hate this game. <laughs> oh my god. That was the fastest dead run I've had.
I can't believe. Just that, that was so... You, you wouldn't read about it. In the words of the great Pimp Knight, you wouldn't read about it. It's something you can only experience. I need Radita though, or I need a Nicket. Like this one. And it needs to be... <sighs> this Nicket has to have, um... The Snicket better have run away or I'm in trouble. I I mean I did hit the end I did hit this this the stream ending button and I'm Honestly, if I don't get to the end of this one, I'm just going I'm I seriously am just gonna end the stream. Let's see. Okay, Nickit's got run away. There, no more Raditas. I don't know when Thieve or when Nickit evolves into Thievel. Hopefully, it's at a higher level. Yeah, the like getting getting set up has like hasn't been too bad this today. But sweet mercy. I was right, I was so close, and then to, to be like, okay, I've got an evolution, I've got Eradicate, not just a Radita. this will make a huge di Like, that, that, that stung more than anything. Alright, 4096. Lowsdale Hollow. Let me run. Thank you. Flip that switch. Cross the bridge. Go down. At this point, I'm just angry. Roly coly coly poly. Wish I had a nickname for Roly coly. I like, I like that line. I don't ever get the chance to use it. But I like that line. I like their aesthetic. I think they're cool. I mean, I guess they're kind of hot, but they're cool. Um. Uh, Gus, are you in the chat? I don't trust what that says. Cade Panda, can one of y'all translate that? And if I need to delete it, I will, because I don't trust whatever that is, because it's in a a font that I'm having a hard time reading, and I don't trust. I'll reluctantly say hello, Rose, welcome to the stream. You straight up reported and blocked. All right, then that's exactly what I'm gonna do is get that out of here. Just gonna remove. Cause uh, something tells me, wish you could, but it would wreck your internet connection. All good. Yeah, I'm sorry if it's not the case. I'm going to ask, please use regular English characters because I only speak English. Um, and I can't read whatever comprehensible garbage that is. I can't believe I'm... I'm 
I'm getting to the point where some of these like bad actors and bots and whatever the heck else have been coming into my streams and doing weird stuff like this. It's kind of nice, but also obnoxious as heck. Because, uh, don't really feel like dealing with that kind of stuff. I don't. But here we are anyway. Hopping! Ooh, coughing with neutralizing gas. Yes. Snarl. Okay, accuracy fell. That's fine. I will throw a Pokeball. And while that's doing that... Nice! Nicket, oh no, Nicket also evolves, uh, like, if I get a level up, I'm in trouble with Nicket. Because Nicket evolves at level 18, and we are 20-something. So gotta watch out for Nicket. Okay, there's a Banet, which is absolutely fine. I can try to cancel Evo if I need to. Your internet's hanging on by a thread. That's okay, I got it. I deleted I've I've deleted the message. So I think we're good enough. Alright, two great balls. Hopefully Nope. That's just a coughing. I already have a coughing, thank you. We'll still go and heal up, so that way coughing's at full health, and maybe if we run into a Haunter between now and by the time I get to the Pokémon Center... No? Okay. Come on, let me go ahead and do this. Haunter! 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 24! Yes! Perfect. Perfect. Uh, let's throw a Pokeball first. This way, if Haunter goes for Curse, it'll already lose that little bit of HP. Okay. Um, Hex, okay. Home Claws didn't necessarily need to go for that, but okay. Uh, let's go for one Snarl. There's the Curse! Brick. Darn it. Should have just gone for it turn one. Oh, well. Live and learn, I guess. But it sure would be nice if another haunter would just show up. What was that TikTok meme for a little while where like where people would would scatter things across the side the sidewalk and be like, "Oh no, I sure hope that a person that would be interested in these kind of things doesn't run up to me and want to be my partner or something." Like what what would I have to do to um do that for a haunter? "Oh no, I hope a spooky ghost doesn't show up behind me and want to be my best friend." I sure would hate if that were to happen. A spooky ghost with hands and no other physical, uh, physical traits. Coughing, you don't have hands. Like, I remember, um... I only remember seeing one that was, a, like, a teacher and one that was, uh, trying to attract a gym bro. Like, the teacher was was throwing um, whiteboard markers, and then the one, the person trying to attract a gym bro was sprinkling, like, protein powder down the sidewalk. <laughs> and that's honestly, like, it's beautiful and hilarious. But, oh no, I sure would hate it if somehow a haunter were just 
were to just show up and get inside of my Pokeballs. I have so, so many Pokeballs and so many empty slots on my team. It sure would be ter- There we finally- I just have to talk about my Pokeballs. <laughs> no, you already went for curse. You lived on too. All right, here we go. This will be great. Ball. One, two, three. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. All right, let's heal up so Haunter will have more than two hit points. And then we can... Uh, your butt clenched something fierce. I don't blame you, because honestly, kind of same. Okay. Let's heal the party. And now that I've got Haunter... We are set. Just gotta go to the port, port looking space, whatever it's called. Ooh, coughing with neutralizing gas is actually a bit of a problem for me trying to get away because it won't let me use the runaway ability. I have to just hope that Nick gets fast enough on its own, which. I mean, it's coughing. Okay, gotta put in five, four, eight, seven. Okay, and then we've already read all of the books or all of the letters. So hopefully that means this will be a fast run where I just go straight to the top. Third floor, second floor, first floor, and I guess this is supposed to be ground. Hello, someone out there? I already know what you're about to tell me, don't bother. Really? I don't remember doing that. I guess I've been trapped in here for far too long. I must be going loopy. Oh, no, honey. Hey, who are you? I'm the behavior expert they sent. Oh, oh, Kira, right? I don't have time. Uh, I don't have time to talk about it. I need to get through that door. Well, you can try, but there's no way you're opening it. Yeah. Oh, oh, I should have left with Haunter. Uh oh. Well, forgot to do that. And it just skips me straight to this. Are you Zeta 07? Are you part of Bruble 2? Huh. Ooh, this time it's only level 23. Well, gonna go for nest. Ooh, ooh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Snarl, future sight, that's fine. Look at that damage. Look at that damage. Let's go. Let's go for Snarl again. Okay, precognition. You're gonna protect yourself. Okay, nice. Took the future side attack, but it doesn't affect me. We might not have even needed, because we got here really fast. So it's only level 23. Nick, it's 21. If I go for Snarl again, precognition. Ah, oh, it protected itself. I'm plus four, plus four and using Snarl. 13 HP. Here we go. Precognition. It's protected. That's unfortunate. And I've got two more Snarl. Oh, so close. So close. So close. Okay. But now, if I go into Haunter... Oh, that was so close. We almost won with just Nicket. Alright, precognition, that's fine. 
Curse. Nice. We win. We win. Nice. I'm sorry. Huh? Ruble. It's you. All those forms I've seen, they're you. You were their experiment. They broke your trust, and it broke you. They hurt you. You were so frightened, you split into pieces. I won't let it continue. I won't let them keep hurting you. I will set you free, all of you. Part of Bruble. Ooh, it's even bigger. Wing attack. Oh, that didn't do anything. How's my party looking? Not that great. Okay. I want to swap into coughing. Neutralizing gas. Let's fight and go for... Let's go for a smoke screen. And then clear smog. Ooh! Second, uh, you lost to the second boss and then it just brought me to the second boss on the next run? Oh, good to know. Okay, future sight. It's gonna be terrible when I get hit by it. Like that. It's gonna go for a wing attack, but there was no target. Alright, next. Let's go into Haunter. Fight. Curse. Huh? What did I get hit by? Huh? Did I get hit by a, a second future site? I didn't get... Huh? Huh? Um, <sighs> come on. I, I don't know what I, I guess I was getting hit by a, like a constant hit of those, um, future sites, I guess. I guess I need to catch something else that's going to be kind of tanky. Like, something tankier than coughing or not weak to psychic? So not Talo. Running from Talo is an absolute nightmare. I definitely think I need to have a Nicket. Or just a dark type. A dark type Pokemon in general. But I think Nickit's the only dark type Pokemon I've run into, is it? Isn't it? Ooh, I could catch a Paras Seed. That would be a good addition. That would be a good addition to the team. That way. That way when I run into Yeah. Okay. All right, heal me up, please. Thank you, you bitch. I don't like her, but you're also the only thing keeping me alive right now, so I have no choice but to appreciate you for what you do for me. Before I have another, uh, another cogn cognitive reset. You're the only thing keeping me alive right now, so I guess I'll accept you for what you're doing for me. I don't like it. I don't like you, but I guess I'll forgive you. 
or at least accept your kind your quote unquote kindness. All right, super repels, super potions, some pokeballs. Not super balls. Which one's the super ball? Is that the great ball? Is great ball? Yeah, cuz I know the hyper ball. The ultra ball is hyper ball. But I don't remember is Great Ball Super Ball? I'm not gonna look that up because it's not as important. I did reach the second form and then promptly got eliminated. I was close, but I think I think there was a weird glitch with how the um when you get to the pink one it should be catchable. Okay. Oh, that's 4 HP. Well, here goes nothing. I'm very motivated. Uh, I am motivated by spite. That is something that I tell people every day of the week. One of the things that keeps me motivated is spite. Ooh, I forgot. Ooh, please, 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 please have let this Rattata have run away. Yes! Okay, that's actually huge. I'm sad that I'm not going to have a Nicket, though. Because Nicket was, like, the biggest part of me getting through that. I am motivated by spite, though. And a little bit of, like, that completionist sake. But after that blue screen, I was very uh, demotivated. Like, that killed me on the inside, that we were that close. And then I got a blue screen like that. Like, that just killed me. 4096. I got a blue screen. Um, I let my Radita evolve into Radicate, and apparently the game didn't like that because it was it didn't prepare for the fact that someone could theoretically, possibly, uh, evolve a Radita into Radicate because getting experience in this game is damn near impossible. But if you catch a Pokemon, it gives you experience, which I don't think the developer was intending to happen so i think that would like they they tried to work around the fact that you shouldn't be getting experience at all so when i leveled up my radita and it got um it got to evolve and to eradicate it um it, it made it did a goof All right, flip the switch, put in 1140. So yeah, that's it's been it's been a fun trip, you know. All right, Geo dude. Hmm. Nah, let's run from the Geo. Ooh, actually, you know what would have been a really good catch that I should have considered? That Clefairy a second ago. Oh, okay. Nope. Can't go back. Once I enter here, I can't turn around, so... Okay, I guess I'm not getting a Clefairy after all. Or a Ferrothorn. I forgot to catch a Ferrothorn! Oh, good. There's still more cave I can run through. That's probably a Woobat. Nope, it's a car. A Roly Coley. My Thradita up front, I can run away really easily, which is incredibly nice. Paris. Hold 
Let's see, so... No, if it was level 22, I would catch it. If it was level 22, I'd catch it. Because level 22 is when... when Paris learns Spore. So, if I find a Paris that's level 22, I can catch it. I can also tell I am incredibly stiff and I need to do some stretching. Y'all can't see me rolling my shoulders like this, and it's kind of funny. Okay, it's only level 20. I need 22. Actually, I don't think I've... Have I been down this part of the cave yet? I don't know if I have been. Yes, I have. I don't think there's anything down here that I need, but... Ooh, Carbank. Carbank. Hold on, let me look at Carbank's stats. Because I think... Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Carbank. Come to Ethy. Uh... Let's just throw a ball. I'll throw like three or four Pokeballs. Got some rice and cooked a couple eggs for a quick dinner. Oh, that sounds pretty good, honestly. Okay, one, two. Oh, Carbank, please. Ooh, guard, sp guard split. Hello, okay. Uh, I guess we'll go for takedown. Thank you for the, um, thank you for that carving. Honestly, thank you. That guard split gave me the extra bulk I need to live a, a couple more attacks and the confidence to, oh, whoop. That was the wrong button, but okay. Item. Pokeball. Having to use the C button at all confuses the heck out of me. Oh, it got the Omni Boost. Okay, I'm in trouble. Uh, Great Ball. Because I kind of want this Carbink for in case the second form has any kind of... Um, dragon moves like the first one did. And a heal powder. Nice. That might come in handy. Okay. I still really want a Ferrothorn because I think that would be really nice to, especially if it had uh, iron barbs. That would be a really nice ability to have. But it's not looking like I'm gonna get it. Ooh, Paris level 24. Okay, item, Pokeball. How many Pokemon is that? Two, three. Aw, oh, come on, Paris. Don't do this to me. And you're gonna poison me? Okay, so Paris will be four. Coughing will be five. And then Haunter will be six. Perfect. Nice. Paris and an ether. So now this Paris should have. It's holding a tiny mushroom, jolly nature, dry skin, poison powder, absorb, fury cutter, and spore, baby. Okay, poison doesn't affect me in the overworld. Thank God. And this is perfect. If I lose this round, I might just quit. I might just quit. Especially, it's getting late. I 
have to go to work tomorrow, but there's not really that much going on at work tomorrow, so I don't really care if I stay up late. Okay, coughing. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay. Do you have neutralizing gas? You do. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw a ball. I mean, I'm not really sleep- I mean, I just had a nap, so it wouldn't be the end of the world if I stayed up super late. I could probably stay up the rest of the night if I wanted to. I'm not going to because I- I know better. But, I could if I wanted to. Sludge, ouch. And I got poisoned, come on! Alright, item. Go for a Pokeball. And a one, two, three. Nice. I constantly keep looking at Discord and I, every time, I know it's Panda. I know it's a, it's a DM from Panda, but I keep, I keep like, I want to keep it there so I remember to look at it later. But then I keep looking at Discord and seeing, oh, I have a DM, I need to look at it. Oh, no, it's Panda. And it's just a vicious cycle. But I don't want to forget about it, so I leave it there. But I can't, I can't, uh, oh, ah. I hate this. I hate that I'm doing this to myself. Oh, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is bad. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Please let me out. Thank you. Okay. I'm in the town center. I think it's right... Yeah. This one. I've got coughing and Paris. And this is looking to be a pretty good team for what we've got to do. Also, I want to go into my pockets and make sure that Bruble is holding loss. Okay, so now all we need is a Haunter and we're Gucci. Not a Muck. I like Muck, but not a Muck. Come on, Haunter. Actually, wait until I get these Great Balls, please. Thank you. And I forgot where I got the Ultra Balls from. Those would be nice to have, too. Wait, can I catch the second form? I haven't tried. I think someone said the pink one should be catchable. Okay, yeah. Tom said it should be catchable, so we're going to try to catch it. Which is why part of why I have Paris. There we go. Haunter's level 21. Perfect. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Now then. Bite. Bite. No, you used curse. Uh Haunter, why? Why do you do this to me, Haunter? Haunter, please. Haunter. Do I have to go back into that into that meme? It sure would be a shame if a floaty ghosty Pokemon were to show up behind me and only have hands and a face and wanted to join my party. I, especially now that I have Ultra Balls, it sure would be a shame if I had to use them on a friend. Not Taylo. Honestly, Taylo have been the bane of my existence since I started playing this game. Like, I like Taylo. It's a good Pokemon, but also it's obnoxious as heck because I can't run away from it. Not when I've got Bruble. Oh no, it sure would be a shame if I got... If I got spooked by a ghost in the middle of this town that's completely deserted and empty. It sure would be terrifying. Oh no. Is that what I have to do to start getting Pokemon to come to me? Oh no. Whatever shall I do? 
Sure would be a shame if I had a ghosty buddy. I did say ghosty buddy. Wait, does Rotom learn curse? I don't think it does. I'm gonna look anyway. No, it does not. Okay. Good to know. I shall summon Haunter with the worst rated horror movies. Ah, there's an idea. Um, hmm. Worst rated horror movies. That's something I haven't thought about in a minute. What are some, like, some of the worst horror movies? Movies that use religious symbolism as a form of horror. Yes, thank you, Hunter. <laughs> Seriously, th those are the worst kind of movies, in my opinion. If if your movie is upside down, upside down crosses and pentacles or pentagrams, I'm sorry, trash movie, bad. You are a disgrace to horror. You are a disgrace to the religion that you are trying to pander to. You are a disgrace to the religion that you are um, not making fun of, but the, you are a disgrace to the religion that you are using to be a, uh, a horror factor uh, to the religion that you are pandering to. So, based haunter right here. All right. No, 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 this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. Ooh. I will let it learn crunch. Okay. Oh, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad, this is bad. No. Cancel. Oh. Oh, God, I would have cried. I actually would have just cut the stream right there. If that didn't work and I couldn't cancel the evolution the stream would have just ended right there. But at least Radita has, has crunch instead of just bite. So now we're set. Nothing can stop us now. <laughs> oh, seriously, I was like, I was about, I, another moment of I'm ready to shit my pants. This stream has been full of me being ready to shit my pants. I feel like that's what I get for naming the stream What the Fungus. Okay, this one is 5487. And I need to be leading with Haunter. We're still going. We're almost there. We're almost done. We've got Haunter up front. We've got... We, like, if we don't, if we don't lose thi this, if we, if we lose this time, I'll probably just call it. But we're, we're just, we're right there on the edge where I think we can, I think we can do it now that we've, now that we're in, like, we, we know what the second form is and we know how to kind of do it. Are you Zeta 7 Are you part of Ruble 2? Oh. Ah, uh, no, we have to fight the first form again. Well, that's unfortunate. But that's okay. So, cut its HP for the curse. So now we'll fight, go for payback, outrage. That's fine. Because that's what we've got Carbank for. Because now Carbank can just sit here and go for Smackdown, I guess? We don't have to worry about 
You definitely did not have to do this. You lucky bitch. But that's okay. I'm sorry. Huh? Bruble. It's you. All these forms I've seen. They're you. You were the experiment. They broke your trust. It broke you. They hurt you. You were so frightened, you split into pieces. I won't let it continue. I won't let them keep hurting you. I will set you free, all of you. Okay. So... I think it makes me lead with Bruble. I want to throw one Great Ball and see what happens. One. Nope. Okay. It's worth a show. No. Use next Pokemon? Yes. We're going to use Harris. Fight. Spore. Dazzling Gleam and we fainted well it was worth a shot to try a dazzling gleam okay coughing can take coughing can take a couple of hits from this thing okay i can go for sludge Future Sight, but it failed. Sludge. One more Sludge. Alright, that's looking good. Ooh, it was poisoned. Okay, I take... Okay. And now we can go into Carbink. We still have Rattata. Ooh. Okay, let's throw an Ultra Ball. It's poison, it's at 3 HP. Come on. A one, a two, a three. Click! We got it! Yes! Oh, that feels so good. Um. Add to party? Choose a, a party member to release. We're gonna get rid of Paris. You found an ether. Nice job there. Yes. Wait, no, it was more of a British. Yes, excellent, excellent job. I don't know. Now, where's the helicopter you boys came here in? Uh, was on the roof of Lowsdale Hospital, sir. Left around 1400 hours, but it should be returning soon. We'll head, we'll head there and wait then. Let corporate figure out how they want to deal with this mess. What was the code for the helipad again? Four, 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 three, five, five, six. Hey. Oh. Oh. Okay. That's what that's for. We got that at the. Wait. Yeah, we got that at the bottom. We didn't get it at the top. Oh. Oh yes. Come with us, Kira. All right. Before that, I'm going to need you to hand those Pokedolls over. I'm sure you understand, it's a particularly dangerous species, needs to be properly contained, etc. Just pass them over to me and we can get going. Your game must have crashed because you didn't- Ooh, alright. Refuse. Hand. Them. Over. No. What? I won't let you keep hurting Brubel. Brubel! Whoa. Whoa. What? What? No! Here, no! No! Are, no! 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 No, no, no! Screw this game! No. I 
I refuse and act in... And then I get an Arceus cry and then reset? Nah. Nah. No. No. That's it. That... No. Nope. We... We won. But then we refused to hand over Bruble, and then, uh... We got... We got reset to the start all over again. So now we have to re-go... We have to go through all of that all over again. I beat the game. I don't care. I'm done. Not after that. Uh-uh. No. Thanks for showing up, y'all. Tomorrow's a Just Chatting stream. It's not gonna be anything special. It'll probably last an hour to an hour and a half. See y'all at 10 p.m. Eastern tomorrow. Thanks. Good night. Don't forget to take your medicine. Good night. Some bullshit. Well, let's see what this game is that Panda sent me. Oh, hello. Oh, I've got to talk to Panda about this. 